hey guys so in today's video we are going to do the difference between a trading account and profit or loss account so before we start with our example of this part one guys i want us to understand what are we looking for when we prepare a trading account and what are we looking for when we prepare a profit or loss account okay so i drafted a note here that i'm going to show you on the screen uh, as well as format that you need to use okay when we talk about a trading account a trading account is used to calculate the gross profit or loss of the business it includes all direct expense and direct income related to purchase and sales of goods okay the format of trading account usually look like this okay we have an opening stock we have purchase we have a a return if we return some goods that we purchase from our supplier we have to subtract them okay a carriage or a transport if we pay a transport we also have to record on our debit side then after that we have to less a closing stock then we will get our gross profit okay as well as a, a sales if we have any we need to record it okay then we have a profit or loss account on the other hand is used to calculate a net profit trade account we want to calculate a gross profit in other words if you know the income statement guys you know very well that when we calculate gross, gross profit is sales minus cost of sales but cost of sales in this case guys is calculated through a formula of opening stock purchase minus return and so on and so on okay as i said guys under trading account we also have to calculate a sales if we have any but for this example of today we don't have it okay then profit or loss this include other income as well as what less expenses you don't subtract other expenses under trading income it's fall under profit and loss okay let's take the format of profit and loss we have a gross profit that we calculated from trading account then from there we less indirect expense and indirect income what is the difference between indirect income and sales indirect income is like other income simple as that okay then after that you will get what a net profit or a net loss okay now let's do example okay so we are going to do example uh, of these two account okay we can do it in in form of t account it's also fine okay we're gonna have a debit side as well as a credit side okay i think this one i will draft it on the other side okay this is our t account we have a credit side and a debit side just like this okay okay let's me move a camera a bit so that you will be able to see this side okay there it is so now let's draft a format of trading account as you can see on the screen uh, on the debit side we have opening stock we have purchase okay then after that we have a carriage on purchase and we also have return is this side guys okay because it's minus returns and we also have a closing stock okay then after that we're gonna do the balancing figure which is going to give us a gross profit profit this side loss this side okay now let's draft a format of a let the, let's draft a format of a profit or loss account 
Okay, a profit and loss account, we start with a gross profit. Okay, we're going to have a gross profit. We're going to have less expenses. Okay, and we add other income. And then after that, we're going to calculate our net profit. Okay, this is a profit or loss account. Okay, now let's check our example. For example, let's say the company has the following information. Opening stock, we have been given 10,000. I'm going to record it like this. Purchases, 50,000. Okay, return, they return 2,000 uh, goods. Carriage inwards or carriage on purchase is 1000 okay less closing of 12000 then if you check the higher side of yes is this one which means that we are going to balance it with a profit which is gross profit okay so if you calculate the balancing figure, this side is going to give you 60,000, 61,000. And 61,000 minus this is going to give you 47. Okay, if I did my calculation proper, it's going to be 47,000. 61. Yes, it's going to give you 50, 47. Okay, then after that, we move with our gross profit this side. It's going to be 47,000. Uh, this side. Then after that, we check if we have other income and expenses. Okay, then other income is 4,000. It's going to this side. Then expenses is 8,000, is coming this side. Okay, then this side is the one which is higher. I think this side you're gonna get 51. 51,000. And this side is 51,000. Then the difference will be 43. Okay, 43,000. If you add 43 with 8,000, it's going to give you 51. So this is our net profit of 43,000. You can do it in, in form of T account or you can just use a straight method like the one that I showed on the screen. So this is how you should know the introduction of trading account as well as profit or loss account. So I'm going to do part two which is going to have a complex transaction so that you can have more clarity of the difference between these two so i hope you learn something please make sure that before you leave subscribe to this channel so that you can get notification of more content of accounting i'm gonna see you on the next one